which reminds me, I, um, I have this record. Someone sent me out a record. It's a tape, and uh, it has the William Tell Overture on it by a barbershop quartet, if you can imagine that. I cannot. I found it in my office today, along with some letters. I'm trying to get caught up on this stuff. And, uh, anyway, there it was. And sitting down there now, and I just got to thinking about it. I said, the William Tell Overture by a barbershop quartet. It's got to be pretty special. So maybe later, when I leave here, I'll go down to my office and I'll get that. Richard, if you please, would you open up the lines? The numbers are 872-1010, 872-1010. Here's the drill. You get to call um, and talk about whatever it is you want to. I don't care. 872-1010. There's a few things I'll cut you off for, you know, but I had a good time today. You know what I did today? Richard, you'd like this. I taught a class of young students, uh, graduates, really, of the... Uh, National Institute of Broadcasting next door to us, and I did a lecture for their a sort of postgraduate, whatever it was, after having graduated, but prior to having made their demo tapes kind of lecture. And I really enjoyed it. Very, very touching. And um, so, anyway, that was fun. 872-1010 is my number, 872-1010. Um, great article in the Toronto Star today about me, picture, everything. Suck on that, Warren Gerard. Anyway, it's a nice article, and uh, you might enjoy it. Has a couple of minor inaccuracies in it. Uh, about where my wife's from. A couple of little small things that are wrong. But in general, it's a nice article by Greg Quill in today's Toronto Star. My phone number is 872-1010. Before I drag out my basket of magic topics... I thought you might have something that you would care to contribute to this program tonight by dialing 872-1010 right now and getting in line, and it will take you long. Or, if you're out in the province and you want to call us without having to pay for it, you dial 1-800-561-CFRB. 1-800-561-CFRB. Or, here in town, 872-1010. lot of comment today about the Ted Wallachian show last night. They just loved it. Loved it. Anyhow, I'm uh, getting ready to split, and I think we'll move right into the... Uh, we have phone calls already. I think I'll... Big climax, big climax. Ooh. CFRB, you're on the air. Hi. Hi. Yeah. We got Ed. Yeah. Yeah, I just uh, phoned to uh, say that I'm a first-time caller. Oh, uh, well, that's something. Yes, sir. And uh, last night, I guess it was the first time I heard you on the air. I uh, was listening to the ball game and swung it around and happened to hear the comments on this guy with his three-hour erection. <laughs> yeah. Starting with Hooters and uh -huh. starting with cheese. And... Yeah, it was wild. Yeah, yeah. Wild? It amazes me. Yep. You know, people haven't got too much to do. But anyway... I hear you leaving. Well, here you are. And uh, you were in the paper tonight. No, oh boy. Today. Good article. Did, did you like that article? Did I like it? Yeah. Well, really, I don't know you, and I haven't heard your program that often, but mm. I did listen last night and wonder what the hell's with people. Oh. But anyway, there's a song, So Long It's Good to Know You. Yeah. The only thing that can happen... Let me ask you a question. What's before, that? before you continue, just yeah. before I let you blubber on. Okay. Let me ask you a question. Do you really think that I am so stupid that I'm going to let you conclude your diatribe against me as you try to slither up to an insult in your life. You really haven't listened to this program long enough. CFRB, you're on the air. Hello. 